Okay, so M855 track is here. The cheap 55 grain full metal jacket track is here. The neck is about three inches long for the cheap full metal jacket, about six inches long for the M855. The bulk 55 grain full metal jacket starts to disrupt right about here, and the M855 starts to disrupt right about here. Temporary stretch cavity is roughly eight inches by two inches on the 55 grain and eight inches by two and a half on the M855. Total penetration 22.1 inches. So over here out of frame in this second block. Let me see if I can get it. Let's see if I can get it dug out of here. There's the recovered projectile. Again, like most of the other full metal jacket, it did squish a little bit of lead out of the base, but no proper fragmentation at this velocity. You can see minor fragments coming off of the track from both the M855 and the 55 grain here, 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 although it's nothing to write home about.